listen, what, what's going on elsewhere? Because you, you're very shrewd. Here's the thing, say what you like about Katie, I know just about everyone does, but yeah. <laughs> uh, you're a grafter, I know that. You work hard and you have a pretty shrewd business uh, head on you. Uh, I like to think so. You, you've, you've, you've had books out, you've had uh, books about yourself and you've put your name to novels as well. You have perfumes out, you've done reality shows, you've done all... What are you into most at the moment? What are you doing right now? I actually like doing the books. I've got six pony books out for the kids. Obviously, I'm into horses as so well. When you say, yeah, when you say pony, that. that's not rhyming slang for they're not very good. That means <laughs> they're about horses. They are about horses and horse stories for younger kids. OK, yeah. Um, now, and do you write these yourself? Because often, uh, and I'm not uh, being disparaging, but often people don't have the time to do it, and celebrities themselves say they're involved in books and they kind of help out the actual, shall we call I it typing? I don't do the actual typing, no. no, no. no. But you're so involved I've got other stuff. all the oh, way through. Totally, everything I do. Um, and the perfume I'm really into... Obviously. Yeah, I have your perfume here. I have. Uh, this is, is this. Is it one perfume? You have more than one perfume. I've got another one coming out already right. soon. Okay. Uh, why? why <laughs> the, now they call these. I believe there's a name for these uh, perfumes, which are they're called. Oh, there's a, for perfumes which are kind of like they're attached to a celebrity name, but they're not kind of like. I can't remember what they're called. It's something. It's not prestige. It's. Um, Chestage, I'm thinking of, but it isn't chestage. <laughs> there, is a, there is a name, I won't be able to think of it, I'm, say that, I'm sorry, but there is a word for, you know, it's like uh, they're, they're kind of high volume, they sell really well, but they've got a name. To... Christ, that's sweet. Like me? Have you smelled no. it? Do you, do you know? Do you wear the perfume? Yes, I do. of course I do. Jonathan, as a guy, right? Yes, sir. I, I'm, which we know, I, I do work a lot, but I'm oh, married. Wait a second, just wait. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm married to a woman that works too much. So oh, you you think it can almost you think appear. She should be at home a bit more with you. Uh, no, no. <laughs> we need our space. Right? We need our space. But I'm just saying, you know, it's like, it's uh, you know, it's good because she works. She's a good businesswoman. Yeah. But I just couldn't take on a hundred things at once. You know, I'm happy with. But women can multitask. Not. Listen. <laughs> it is. You leave Guys, him. Help me out. Hey, yeah. if I leave you with the three kids. And they all cry. Oh, you phone I'm, me up. Why have you know. left me with all the kids? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but that's a lot of work. That is a, a lot of work for your kids. And, yeah, you know, it's especially with a new baby. That's always... Yeah. Uh, all you've got to do is say to yourself, enjoy the crying. And it will just ring in your ears and it'll be all right. See, I don't have your... Can I ask you a question which is a very personal question? Oh, we like that. Uh, do you breastfeed? Never. <laughs> they are my puppies and mine only. Hey. <laughs> Well, occasionally you can touch them. <laughs> very no, I don't. Very you know, strict. some people do, some people don't. But I just, it's just not for me. You don't fancy it? No, but there's nothing wrong with it. It's good for the baby. Well, I know there's nothing wrong with it. It's been seen for the last 40 years. The only reason years, why, <laughs> as well, I bottle feed because I think it's important for the dad to bond. And if the baby. So he breastfeeds me... with you. <laughs> well, I know. But I'm no, it's important. Too. Hey, look at that. Who remember that young lad? Whatever happened to him? Look at that physique there. Uh, <laughs> Katie, is what? he still? He hasn't. Is he? No, is look... he in good shape now? Or... Actually, when he did get meningitis, one thing he was happy about. He lost so much weight, yeah. and he was actually <laughs> happy about that. But I like that about your glasses half full kind of person but I I was not happy then I really wasn't happy I mean I was so stressed two hours a day seven days a week yeah. I mean and you know guys they'll always they'll see you in the street and go wanker you know they'll, they'll call you everything <laughs> because they don't want to see some bloke flashing his chest well, you so now I've like got a wife eaten, that can you, do it it's you fantastic like you've eaten a <laughs> I'm sorry I tried that that was a very good joke uh, that wasn't bad was it have a look at that again will you uh, Katie <laughs> <laughs> I knew what he was doing. What? Yeah. I wanted her to enjoy you in your oh, prime. That's all. That's all. Don't you think I did this as well? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, okay. Now, um, uh, the shows you've, you've been involved in. How many reality shows, or do you call them reality shows? How many shows are where you've allowed cameras into your, your house? Have you been involved with? Well, the ones that are in America, they're showing. They're on our third one now, I think, aren't they? Yeah. They've done yeah. the wedding. Um, and obviously, the one that's just been on. We're still filming our other one while we're doing the chat show. Um, but do you know what? It really doesn't bother us with the cameras. We're so used to it. You, well, how often are they there? I mean, how much control do you have in other oh, parts of the house where you don't allow them? Are they not allowed in every room? Or what are the rules? I only like them. I'm really awful. I don't... If anyone comes to the house, like a postman or anything, I go, don't you dare let them look in the house, because it's my privacy as yeah. well. So I'm like, answer the door like but that. But you let the cameras in there? Only in the oh, kitchen. No. Uh-huh. Only in the red room and the cinema room, because he wanted to show it off. But she'll invite someone up, right? Oh, do you want to come over? As soon as they get there, she's like, oh, shit, you answer the door. So I go hey, answer the door. That. I, I hate don't it when people know. come to my house. I hate it when they... Yeah, but she invited them. Yeah. Hey, I'm not doing that. Everyone's going to think no. they're not going to be then welcome. Then she went upstairs. I yeah, but... stood there saying, hi, mate, how are you going? 
Um, yeah, do you want a cuppa? Yeah, come in. What the fuck are they doing in the house? Excuse my language. <laughs> so I'm... No, if there are people there to do jobs and, and I'm, like, stuff... Yeah. There like a, yeah. You know, like if now. he's but cooking, he's about... different to me. <laughs> Whatever. But I think Peter was talking... Am I... Suddenly, I'm a counsellor. I'm not... I'm a... <laughs> I think what Peter was saying yes. uh, was that he meant when you invite friends over... No, you, not you... friends. Oh, shut up, Pete, when friends She's come saying over. that, so if they're watching... But she's really, gonna... seriously, You're no, no. You're all me later. But, Katie, I understand. When people come to my house, although I'm very pleased to see them, nothing so sweet as saying goodnight to them. You know, I, I, I no, we well. love people. We love people. It's just sometimes, you know, you know. You know. You're, you're no, a young couple. You've you got mean. children to look after. Well, well, don't fall out now on the show, for no, Christ's sake. Won't. You know. No, so we, we love each. other. Actually, we're really, we're really like. This is the thick. Sorry, taking over again. Um, you were talking time. about these magazines saying that about marriages and yes, that. Yes. I, I reckon we're a really strong unit. You know, we've got three kids. We love each other. Um, she happens to be beautiful. It kind of, it's a good life for me right now because work's going well, personal life's going well, and the kids are just the icing. Uh, well, listen, uh, I, I know you're quite outspoken, but uh, I read that um, you were talking about Posh and Bex going to LA and people were trying to draw a parallel that you guys were uh, entering the kind of American entertainment world as well. Do you, do you have any contact with those guys at all? Do you? I have nothing against Victoria and David. I love her boobs, and I wish you'd admit they're fake, because they are. And um, <laughs> with America, they're like tadpoles in America. So are we, and there's so much room for everyone out there, and it's like good luck to them. And yeah, Good but you are us. forgetting one thing. I mean, I'm always stick up for people, always. But I reckon. You no, know, David's talented. Yeah, David's Victoria, what tadpole. does she really do? Nothing. I mean. <laughs> she does. You want to say what you've done about it? At least I can say one thing. You know, at least I've got loads of things to prove that I do things. I am seen with my kids. She's she does look the bollocks just, all the time, just, but she does jack shit. <laughs> David's a multi-talented man, so let's just leave it on the positive. We don't have to you go... You can speak the truth, I am speaking the truth. Well, well, let's try well, well, an experiment. <laughs> you, you don't do anything. Hang on, hang, on, hang on, mystery girl, listen. Why, why don't you... Now, you tell us. <laughs> what do you think of David and what do you think of Victoria? We'll start... Just to be oh, different, we'll start, no, we'll start with nice. Peter. Peter. No, what I do you, don't. What do, you, what do you think of Victoria? Oh, she's really nice. No. <laughs> uh, honestly... Oh, you watched her okay, programme. Oh, OK, 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 OK. For my phone. All right, all right. I don't rate her. You don't I, I never did rate okay. her. That's all I need I to never know. Rate That's all I need to know. But and David, David cool. what do you think of David? He's a really good footballer. That's it. You don't... He's a nice bloke too. I've got. N he's done nothing wrong to me. <laughs> the only person in the world so far. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Okay. Well. I, I, I think let, to let's finish it there. Let, no, no. Let's agree that we move on from this session next time, and we, we deal with <laughs> some of the other issues that are hanging between us, and make sure that that. Okay. I'll need that half an hour with you before the show on Wednesday. <laughs> uh, she says, okay. <laughs> Regardless of whether it happens, I'm going to have a wank tonight. Thinking about it. <laughs> I'll invite you in. We'll be uh, okay. It'll be like a family week. Anyway, listen. <laughs> you might as well. Yeah. What harm could it do? It's only skin. Um, <laughs> okay, of course. Of course you, who would? Who would? Uh, how great to see you both again. Congratulations on all your many projects and, of course, on your beautiful new baby. That's everything. thing. And, uh, Thanks very much. Uh, we look forward to having you on our show, In Jonathan. a few weeks' time, I'll definitely come. I promise you that. Ladies and gentlemen, join me saying thank you to Peter Andre. And thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You're going to stick around for the music, yeah? yeah. OK. My thanks to all my guests this evening. We